Hey guys, welcome back to day four of the July MHC, the Paleontologist Challenge. I got a lot of blocks just laying around there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and smelt up some of my iron because, you know, I've got plenty of it now. And do I need to? Okay, I think I'll be fine um, without making a new pickaxe for now. All right, so um, I've been answering questions <laughs> and I'm almost out of questions actually but um, I have a couple more that you guys have left in the comments and I also have another topic that I said um, I might talk about and um, then I also grabbed the doc that has all of the questions that were um, that came from the discord um, yeah the doc that uh, nursing geek made and uh, I've printed it out so I have those and I have actually answered some of them and had them in comments already so it's a little bit shorter than it was but uh, I might answer some of those if I don't get any more in the comments so um <laughs> that was really loud sorry about that oh no uh okay I've got to figure out what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna I, I should probably make a shovel. I hate making shovels, but this is a lot of, it's a lot of gravel. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's just make one of those. Get out of here. <laughs> I don't have any sticks. Okay. I guess I could make some more torches too because I, I could probably use those. Uh, let's just go ahead and make the rest of those into torches. That's not how you make torches. <laughs> oh gosh. All right. There we go. Uh, so I guess I should go ahead and start answering questions because I don't intend on coming up for air, I guess, uh, today. Oh, darn it. I, I want it to be three wide. I'm not three wide, three high. And so much so much gravel uh yeah so i'll go ahead and start answering questions i guess okay so where we left off is i was talking about um my first videos that i made i really need to make just a hole to throw my junk into because i don't want this stuff uh here Take that, take that, don't need that, don't need that. Get this out of my inventory, please. Okay. I don't need a spider eye. I mean, come on. All right. Um, I have already lost my train of thought again. Are you surprised? You shouldn't be. Let's go ahead and throw those in there too. All right. So, I need to make a new pickaxe. That's what I was going to do. That's fine. I can make it over here. So let's go ahead and throw this down here. Oh, great. I need to make some more sticks. Oh, goodness. Maybe I should make two of these. Hmm. I'm going to be doing a lot of digging. Maybe I should go mine really low and see if I can get some diamonds, but that seems like it's I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's worth it because I would rather spend my time looking for a fossil, which I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't expect to find a fossil in this playthrough and I'm completely okay with that. I just want to be able to play Minecraft again, <laughs> honestly, and um, I'm enjoying myself just digging holes and I hope that you guys are kind of enjoying these videos too. Uh, yeah, but like I said, I fully expect to not find one and I'm completely okay with that. So, if I find one, though, oh my god, that'd be awesome. Oh my gosh. It would be amazing. I would be ecstatic. But, like I said, I don't expect it. <laughs> okay, so, uh, where was I at? Uh, yes. So, uh, I was talking about my old videos, the first ones that I made, and uh, memories about that time and everything. And I think that's where I left off. So, next up is from 
Mustang girl. She has another question. <laughs> and it is, what was your first MHC challenge and when was it? All right. So I've talked about this before. I know. I know I've talked about this before, but I don't mind talking about it because it was one of my favorite challenges. And sorry, I was rubbing, rubbing my eye because I feel like I've got something in it. Um, all right. So the very first, okay, well, first of all, first of all, let me just, let me just say, um, I had a hardcore series on my channel. Well, actually I had two, two hardcore series on my channel. Oh, um, okay. Maybe I shouldn't get into it right the second because I kind of want to look around here. Okay. All right. I saw a creeper. <laughs> I'm going to go up this way a little bit, just to kind of get away and see what's up here. Does this go outside? No, it does not. Okay. Just curious. I do like open caves like this, so I'm going to wander around here and hopefully I can still talk and um, <laughs> not get blown up by a creeper. Oh no, does that go up? Okay, maybe not. Hi. Hello, sir. Please get out of here there we go um okay that does, there's nothing up here. no it does go oh okay um let's just light this up too i just want to be safe that's all uh yeah so i had uh two seasons of hardcore minecraft and um basically i had goals that i had set and um i was trying to set specific uh, set uh trying to achieve specific goals in hardcore uh and mainly not dying and um while i was playing that while i was putting those videos on my channel um i got a message from michael deering because this was back when i think it had only been going on for maybe a year and um he used to do campaigns occasionally where he would um ask people to look for um, other YouTubers who were playing in hardcore and send them messages saying, hey, you might want to check this out. And uh, so that's how I found out about the MHC. Um, I'm gonna keep going this way and just, hopefully this is lit up. Mm, that does not look, yeah, that doesn't look safe. Let's put one more, and let's put one more over here. Okay, I feel a little bit better about that. All right, so uh, yeah, he would, um, message people and um he messaged me and he said hey you should check out the mhc it's really fun it's a thing that i came up with and i said oh okay well i'll look at it and maybe give it a try and that was in I th actually i think it was in like december um of i can't remember what year <laughs> 2013 i suppose and because I'm pretty sure I started in 2014. Uh, so I, I got the message and it was in December and I said that I would check it out and I did watch a few people play and um, I didn't do it though because I was still playing my hardcore challenge world and I wanted to finish that before I get started on something else. So once I died in that world um, by an enderman i actually made it all the way to the end and i was very surprised and very excited about it but then i immediately died uh <laughs> yeah but um as soon as that was over i decided to check it out again and see what was going on and when i saw it i think it was in may of 2014 and it was already in the middle of the month so i missed um i missed that challenge i missed the first episode so I decided to wait until June, if it was one that I wanted to do. But while I was waiting for it, I played the April one. I streamed it actually, I think, just to see if I could uh, talk for 20 minutes at a time. Oh my God, for 20 minutes, because you know, you have to talk pretty much the whole time that you're playing. And I wasn't sure if I could do that because normally when I made my videos, I, I, I heavily edited my videos, so I wasn't sure if I could do it, and so I streamed it, and it turned out all right, and um, I had a lot of fun playing it, so then I just played the May one, just, you know, in my spare time, and I really enjoyed that one too. I don't think I need gunpowder, so I'm going to go ahead and throw it out. Um, 
so yeah, I enjoyed all of that. Make some more bread. And decided that I would go ahead when the June announcement came out and play it. And I did. And the challenge was marry a witch. That was my very first MHC challenge. Um, it has taken me like 10 minutes just to get to this part of the story. <laughs> this is why it takes me so long <laughs> to answer questions. Uh, yeah, so it was the marry a witch challenge. And basically what you had to do, you spawned in a plains, but it was right next to a, uh, right next to a mushroom biome. So mushroom biomes, if you didn't know, um, <laughs> can't even think, mobs can't spawn in mushroom biomes. Um, hostile mobs is what I mean. Hostile mobs can't spawn there unless there is a, uh, unless there's a spawner. Yeah. So if there's a spawner underground in a cave somewhere, then things can spawn there. I'm assuming it's still the same. That's how it was back then. That was a while ago. Um, but the first night you had to go out and you had to, or not the first night, but the first day, basically, he gave you coordinates to a forest and you had to go collect as much wood as you could and saplings and all of that stuff. And you couldn't go back. So once you left that forest, you couldn't go back there. Um, so you had to grab, you know, your saplings and everything so you can make a tree farm and all of that stuff. And uh, you had to marry a witch. And by marry a witch, you had to uh, find a name tag. I th think there were coordinates to name tags in there. And you had to find a witch, which uh, of course the witches would only spawn in the plains, but you were so close that you could go to the plains just to get your witch and everything. That was part of it. And um, you had to name tag your witch. So you got to name her and everything. And once you had her named, you had to, well, you could, you could build the house first if you wanted to, but you had to build a house for her and you had to get her into the house. And it was quite a task. It was really fun though. And I think that most of the people who played it really enjoyed that one. Uh, it's one of my favorites. And, uh, yeah, so I did that one. Um, of course, like the very, like one of the last days, um, I forgot to hit record and um, <laughs> all I had was my voice. So because I, I record my voice and my um, gameplay on two different programs. So um, I had my voice, but I didn't have my video. So I went and <laughs> drew pictures for the whole day or not the whole day because toward the end of it, I realized like, I think I had maybe five minutes left and I went, oh no, <laughs> oh no, I forgot to hit record. And so, yeah, I had to fill up some, <laughs> some of that time, which was really annoying, but I did, I did it and, um, I liked it. It was fun. So that was my first MHC, the Merry Witch. Oh, and by the way, my witch's name was Elphaba, of course, named after the Wicked Witch from Wicked. So, uh, yeah, that was, that was my very first MHC. And like I said, it was June of 2014. I'm almost positive. I would have to go back and check, but yeah, I'm pretty sure. And uh, it was a lot of fun. Enjoyed it. And then the next, uh, the next one, well, basically I did the, I did MHCs for the next, like, however many years it was until like back earlier this year when I didn't do one. That was like the first one I missed was back in January, I think it was. So yeah, I've been playing MHC for a long time. All right, I think that's all I need. So, uh, yep, that was it. So I'm pretty sure I answered that question. I guess I should go on to the next one after I move some of this stuff out of here. All right, so what is the next question? Hopefully that answered that. The next question is from Nursing Geek, and this is actually one that was on the, um, in the, uh, doc, I think. So it is, do you consider yourself more of an adventurer or a miner slash grinder? Or do you think of your play style in some completely different way? I'm definitely an adventurer. I don't mind mining, but 
I find it very tedious and uh, a lot uh, sometimes sometimes it's it's fine it's fun but uh most of the time I like to adventure so yes I am definitely much more of an adventurer there was an MHC that was uh back in December of 2015 I want to say it may have been 2014 I can't remember exactly, but uh, it was in December. I do remember that. And it was called the Great Race. And we basically had to go. Um, we had a starting point and everybody had to go the same direction. And whoever made it the furthest was the winner. And that was one that I really enjoyed because, like I said, I like adventuring. I like traveling in the game. Um, yeah. So that was fun. I think that an interesting one or maybe not interesting but a fun one to do a fun kind of challenging one to do for MHC Michael if you're listening <laughs> um, is to do a biome challenge where you have to try to find as many biomes as you can within the time limit uh, I think that would be fun but that's because like I said I like exploring that's that's what I like I like uh, going around trying to find cool things in the different biomes um, and especially like looking for weird formations in like hillsides and in the sand and stuff like that, because I like to, um, if I find something like that, then I like to build things because, uh, yeah, building is definitely a, um, is secondary for me. I'm not much of a builder. Um, but if I find like a cool place, then I'm more likely to be like, yes, this is perfect. This is, I, I've got an idea of what I want to do here and then I like to build but yeah I am an adventurer and it's funny because I'm an adventurer in real life too kind of <laughs> I like to travel in real life so um I guess it kind of extends to Minecraft um all right so I think that may actually be the end of today so let's see what my thing says mm. yeah today is over um because I've gone long the past two days which is fine um but there we go I guess that is it for today I just made a really long I, I don't know what I'm doing honestly I need to make some like branches and uh maybe I'll do that next time but there we go that is those were actually all the questions I had um there is one topic I wanted to talk about because I mentioned it in a reply to one of my comments um, to Nursing Geek, actually. <laughs> and uh, it is about voice acting. So uh, maybe next time I'll talk about that. And um, I do have, like I said, I do have the questions so um, from the doc, so I can go through some of those too. But uh, if you have any other questions, then let me know and I will see you guys next time. Let me just put a torch right there and gather those. All right. See you guys on Monday. Bye.